to Butler Kennel Rock Wallace today. We got Stanley Gaffney, Stephen Gaffney. Y'all are what? Gaffney's Rock Wallace. Yeah, Gaffney's Rock Wallace. Gaffney's Rock Where y'all located? Two cousins, at? straight from South Carolina. SC! <laughs> That's the hometown, baby. You don't have to look up the hometown. Yeah. All right, so. Tell us about your business first before we even get started, man. Get your name out there. Let's, let's, let's use this platform to get your name out there. Let's, let's do some supporting right now. So tell us where you at, where you're located, what yeah. you're doing. I'm right here at uh, South Carolina, down there near Columbia. You know, straight off Pitch Asher Road. I'm trying to bring y'all that gap in your rock wall. This is going to be my beginning and my starting. Like, this is going to be clean right here. The queen right there. So we got to do a big... So we got season. queen and king. Yep. And they're like what two weeks apart or so. Two weeks apart. Two weeks apart. Yeah. All right. Big boy. So y'all trying to bring it down down to the hometown yeah. and then you know, represent the right way. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah. Right? We're gonna bring that quality down there. Yeah. All right. So tell us a little bit about um shoot your number up, man. Get your number out there. That's when people call them when they are are you are you ready for the numbers yet? Or no, all right, I so? don't think I'm ready for the numbers. All right, yet. you ready for the numbers yet? So but it'll be coming it, soon, then you I'll put it in the link below by the time y'all see these videos and start getting it up there, we get it on there, right? Um but you got Instagram or anything else by following yet? I'm just Facebook. Can't be wrong. All right. So we're going to work on that Instagram and Facebook and everything else and YouTube and all that kind of stuff. So <clears throat> let's let's back all the way up from from the beginning to what, how did you hear about us? What made you call? Um, and what was your experience like from the time you first called to now? Well, I was looking for a rock wallet for a long time. And... Like a good quality, like the way I want, like he like this man right here. Oh man, yeah. Hold on one second. I forgot to do this one thing. I always do. This is King. That's King right there. I want you to see. Get it. Okay. That's Queen, and she is a queen. I'm telling you now. This chick is queen all the way. That's Queen. All right. Now go ahead. Yeah, looking for a rock. Yeah, I've been looking for a rock rock for a while. Yeah. I was I debated first how I had called them and asked them for the prices and everything about the dogs and how it was. I wasn't sure. It was more like the prices. Then so then I started going to buy other dogs and I still didn't see the quality that I wanted. So, you know, they always say go with your first instinct. That's what I should have did. So a year later, I ended up making that phone call, <laughs> and now we're here. And now we're here. Yeah. So, yeah. so I'm glad you pointed on that though, because because we talk about that a lot, and a lot of clients they'll they'll call, they want a dog, price may be too much for them at that time or whatever. But we do offer payment plans and all that kind of stuff. But you know, stick within your budget. But also, there's a difference between just getting a dog and quality, right? So the dogs you first got, you know, you got some of your dogs. You bought them, not your expectations of what you thought they were going to be like. So then now, you got higher expectations, which I like, you know, and you saw the dogs and everything else back there. So tell me what you thought about the dogs. You, you came, matter of fact, tell me what you thought about first when you first got it. Those big thinking? motherfuckers. <laughs> I called my peoples back home in South Carolina and told them, you don't got nothing like this. <laughs> like, yeah, they're right. They're right. They're good. That's good. That's good. I got some. I, I think I made a video of you holding hard for anybody as well too. So I, I'm, I'm gonna post those videos over overlays and stuff as well. All right, what was your What was your experience? Well, yeah, I, my mind was blown. I was happy. I'm glad I came and got what I'm getting. It's, it's, this look way better than what I got. So I already know what the future gonna look like. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Man, nothing, nothing makes me feel more happy and more. I feel blessed actually, man, when I'm able to see. Uh, breeders up and becoming that one and you know the one thing he said to me off camera was man I'm not doing it for the money or nothing else I do it because I love it I don't care about the money part I just do it because I love it and that's the biggest thing that drives and that's the difference you can always see when somebody does this for money it shows differently you know they don't care about the dogs just here take the dogs just go they'll sell to anything uh, when we talk we talk about what exactly what you wanted to do what your purpose and goal was uh, you gonna you understand already? You are gonna lose money before you make money, especially in this breeding business at, at, at first, anyway. So you gotta spend it. You gotta put it in there. But one of the biggest things that really stood out a lot was the fact that you said, "Hey, man, you know, it's not just about the money. It's about I mean, you gotta have love and passion for this. You know what I mean? And that's one of the biggest things people understand, um, especially these rocks. And you can feel that in there. So 
I would I would definitely tell you guys, man, for what I see, you guys look out for big things in South Carolina because if I have to, oh yeah, you got my push behind you, man. All right, so yeah. you got me behind you pushing, and, and, and let's get it going. So this won't be the end of it. I'm telling you now, because once you start to mark my words on my <laughs> this ain't gonna be the end of it. Yeah. I see about two or three more coming. Because <laughs> when you start seeing it, that's the number one thing. They start getting it like, man, I gotta get some more. So, but he got two of them. Uh, these are non-related, so you know they're gonna be some bleeding pairs coming up later on as well too. So, but look for some big things from these guys, man. Honestly, but big things. So all big the way from things. South Kakalaki, yeah. you know what I'm saying? That yeah. South Kakalaki, yeah. you know what I'm saying? That Geech, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> I don't understand with that yet, yeah. but. Child soldier right there. Nah, there you go. <laughs> Why you look yeah? Oh boy, look yeah. You see, look, look at that on, on, on top. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you see this that big. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. Yo, I'm telling them look at this right quick. That's yeah. the hometown of Fly right there, that guy. See, baby. The Geechee, so. Yeah, the Geechee. But it feels good to see hometown people, man, mm-hmm. really all the way from South Carolina, coming all the way to Texas to support and showing that support and love, man. That really means a lot to me. So I don't want you guys to think that it's just about me saying, oh yeah, we got this. But I appreciate you guys because could have went to hundreds and thousands of different people. There's a lot of other breeders in Texas as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we know about that. Yeah, it's a lot of other breeders in Texas. There's some other breeders that will use my name for clout and, and, and say that. I'm gonna say it right now on camera. I'll give a million dollars to anybody else that I bought a dog for them in Texas. If you find people worth twenty dollars, they say that boy brought the dog and started up. <laughs> oh, it's my eyes see. It. I don't know. Yeah, I ain't, gonna, I, ain't gonna, I ain't gonna call no breeders' name, but there's some breeders out there in, in, in Texas love to claim that I got dogs from them to get their name started. So I put it out there right now. I got a million dollars. If you find that breeder in, in, I'm a, in, in Texas and that I got my dog from, so. But yeah, they got people that would try to use your name and lie to get your name out there using my name. So if you don't see me mentioning their name on B Block, you know what I mean? So it's, you know it ain't true at all. So, But quality speaks for itself, man. We ain't got to use it too. There's always going to be someone using your name for cloud. And hopefully, that just shows you that you're doing something right. That somebody want to do something that what you got. So, you know, yeah. we, we definitely keep that uh, keep that going. So, But I hope you see the big difference in, in these other jokers here that what you got here, King and Queen. Yeah. Put them up. He said two weeks apart. Yeah. Ugh, <laughs> me, girl. Hold them. Hold them. No, no. Bring them close <laughs> to the camera. Let's see. Come on. Bring them to the camera. Yeah, right. Two two you... weeks apart now. Nah. Right there. There you e- go. E- Davis. Two weeks apart now. Nah. Come come to SC now. Leaving Houston. But we ain't in Houston. We ain't in Galveston. But we flying out from Houston. We gonna take over the world, baby. And if you can't get them, use Gaffney Transport LLC. We'll get we'll transport them to you. Oh, you can transport them to you? Yeah, I can transport this well. Why so you ain't telling me that, man? We can get them to you. But, but, well, see, now even I know that. Now, if I know, I've been doing, I'm always supporting, yeah. man. You know, I got, you know, I got people always out there. But, so, yeah. so we got some transport company guys as well, too. So, um... Yeah, definitely give him a call. You said Gaffney's Transport and Gaffney's Rock Walk. Get the numbers out, man. You got the numbers uh, out. Phone number is 803 603 5025. Again, the number is 803 603 5025. I'll put the number in below as well, too, as well, in the, in the trans. In the, description below so there we go man we got these here all the way from south kakalaki you know charleston boys man this is how we do and it, it really it really man warms my heart to see you know from the hometown coming out man support it really means a lot bro so look out for big things and uh hopefully we ain't even done yet man. just this is just the start of the beginning so. just the beginning just the beginning and, and you see them shirts, that's what we got, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. next time they come, y'all have some shirts, some gaffer shirts, and then, then I'll put them on as there well, too, right there. Right? Well, uh, yeah. There we go. Yeah, right, we, yeah. So last question I would say is, I know it's a wait time, I know it's a long time wait and everything else. Question is, and you got to be very, one, like, what's the one thing I said in the beginning before we got started, right? Say so it's going to be a wait. It's going to be a wait? Yeah, over here, you told me that. <laughs> it's going to be a wait. It's, it's worth gonna, the wait. But it's worth the wait. That's worth the, the wait. That was the question I was going to ask. The quality. The it's worth the wait. It's not that little white album where they say it's worth the wait. <laughs> it's really worth the wait. <laughs> <laughs> that's the real true quality. That's the that's the thing that gets me, man. Really, the, it's just I, mean, I want you guys to be happy. When you, not like you know, some people get a dog get like that's it, man. That's what he had like that. And I want you to be like, dang, that's what it was. I waited. It was worth it. 
people was wait. I got people announced on the list waiting, calling me. So like, hey man, I'm waiting. But they're patient, man. I, I appreciate everybody that's been waiting patiently and they're getting dogs. But so you see, it's coming. Is this a slow train? We're well, not really that slow, but it's it's. We got a lot of dogs. Just a lot of people putting pots down. And if you want to get on that train, hit us up, man, and we go from there. So, guys, be good. Be blessed. Treat each other right. right. We out. Thank you.